The boy been solid when you ask about your Mac and hard. Always on the line in the trenches like a nose guard. Never been a sucker, man. My knuckle game crazy. Leave your eye like a raccoon punching them out like the baby they say. He a G and he know for keeping it 100. Dirt on my boots, not my name. He's so 100. When you start rapping like that, hit his area with 51. Everything in the butterflies. Go get your man. And I feel like. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'ma tell you what happened. He got smoked. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang. Got my guy with me. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you Shout out to Black, His and Hers. Mm -hmm. All of the Clothing brands and owners out there. Shout out to my man, Larger Than Life, mm -hmm. Trey, my man Trey. Oh, you know what I'm saying? You know, he see, it's, up. It's, it's little details I like here. You see the you see the tips right yeah. there on the shooter. That means they not gonna break. That means they ain't gonna fold. Fall out the washing machine. You know what I'm saying? Then you also see the inner. This this is softer than it was. You know what I'm saying? Shout it's, out to my man, really Larger rocked. Than Life, Trey really L T L. You know what I'm saying? Their clothing brand is out there too. And um, Black Kids and Herds, if you got a clothing brand or you're interested in getting some stuff to us, hit me up on Instagram, Vada underscore fly, on Twitter, whatever the case may be, and we'll do that. But uh, let's get straight to the battle rap, man. We got Chrome 23 coming up. They got their whole card coming up. But before we even get into that, there's another card going down this week on Friday, February 24th. Oh, okay. It's by uh, Taking Over Shit Battle League. In Illinois, shout out to Illinois, shout out to Harvey, shout out to Chicago. Uh, they got some, they got some battlers on here. Uh, Cold day in hell is what I said it's called. It's, it's going down, and then they ha they do have a uh, um, some limited tickets available, and it's called, uh, like I said, the battles are Truthful versus Bad News, Gage versus Moon, Coach Coleon versus Ishmula, Hundred Shot Freddie versus Resco Wells, and um, Shites Fold versus Six the Prophet. So they got a couple of MCs on here I haven't heard much from. But I do know Truffo and I do know Bad News. That that's not a bad battle. I'm not mad at the battle. The battle definitely seems good. I like Truffo versus Bad News. Um, I like Gage versus Moon. I've always loved Moon. I like Gage OGs. too. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like the OGs. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. um, if we going down this card right quick, I'll. Uh, I like what Bad News been doing recently, and I like what Truffo. That's some shit I probably would have to see. How, how you calling that? This to me, it could be a two one either way. Um, Especially because neither one of them are on, you know, uh, on the on the bigger league, so they definitely got to stand out. Yeah. And I think for, mm, I, I think I could go with a slight edge on on bad news, mm -hmm. only because of the wave that he's on right now, and he's definitely cooking. Mm -hmm. Um, but you know, true foe, you count him out, he ends up winning the battle. That's mm -hmm. the reason why I, yeah, I I can see it going. Yeah, and I like uh, and then the moon versus Gage. I definitely like. Uh, I'm going with Gage in that, even though I love Moon too. You know what I'm saying? Moon got that OG talk. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like. He was shooting in the same corner. We was playing tight song. Like yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like I be like that shit too, though, man. That's a pretty good battle too. Um. I'm not mad. I can't. I, I think I'm gonna go with Gage on that one. Right. So Gage. over and all, salute to talking, taking over shit, battle league. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all look out for their card. Uh, shout out to uh, Solid Fo Lucci and everybody else over there. You know what I'm saying? Looking forward to seeing some of these battles. Now, Chrome mm -hmm. 23, uh, Chrome Energy. Salute to Remy Ma, everybody over there at Chrome 23 Thanks. for putting this card together. This is uh, going down. This Saturday, uh, everybody's been talking, you know what I'm saying, the, en the energy, you know, they talk about the energy, right? It's all about energy. Right. Uh, I'll tell you the card first, you know what I mean, and then uh, you can we can break it down and go battle by battle like we normally do. Yep. Um, let's start from showing some love for the ladies. C3 versus Caution, Official versus Prestavia, Vixen, now we get to the fellas, A Ward, uh, Shuni the Rapper versus Miss Hustle, Easy the Black Captain versus... Um, Hit man, holla. How you feel about the card? Just the card in general, how you feel like? I mean, to me, it's a solid card. Mm -hmm. Everybody on the card, you know who they are. Mm -hmm. So it's not like, you know, we got to worry about, you know, trying to, you know, like, a, you know, no offense. or There's no PGs or 1SKs type situation. Well, so, it is. I mean, you know, 1S, caution. Uh, I mean, she, she came up out of it. Nah, know, you know, nah, you know. nah. She was just, she was just cooking on RBE. So That's like, fair. you know what I'm saying? So these names, you, you know. So I think, I think for... Uh, for this card, I, I definitely can see this going up, but we all know why we're here. It's for the main event. Mm -hmm. 
But I'm not mad at all of the other names on the card either. Right, I seen somebody the other day, he jumps in the comments, he's like, Y'all ain't talking about the other battles enough. And I, this is why I come to this channel. I'm like, fam, like, you got to give people some. You got to let us get to breaking it down. You know what I'm saying? Like, the the battles on this card were led by the big name battle. Yeah. So we can get to all the subsidiary things. We're going to get to it. Like, this is what we do here. You know what I mean? But um, It's a schedule thing, too. Yeah, it's a schedule. Like, we usually only do the predictions right before like the event. Like, a week up. Like, yeah, a couple days up. Yeah, I'm about to do a prediction three, three weeks. weeks ago, five yeah, weeks ago. No. no. This is what people want to know about it. Exactly. So, uh, let's go with C3 versus Caution. Mm -hmm. um, I've seen C3 a bunch. I've seen Caution recently a bunch, as most recently as seeing her battle QB. Mm -hmm. Now, QB definitely, to me, seeing it, hearing it, watching it, and QB, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, QB, QB was yeah, good. Like, QB, QB was, was good. good. Um, she got beat by someone with some um, outstanding veteran presence. Now, mm -hmm. while C3 is a veteran, like, she ain't, to me, like, QB is like, up, 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 echelon, you know what I'm saying? A female right. battle rapper. Right. We, she been doing this for a long ass time. And she don't even get the respect that she deserves sometimes. So for her, maybe it's because she's super disrespectful that it takes away. But she definitely got by on Caution. Um, Caution's battling against C3. C3, like I said, legendary performer. Been doing this for a while. Uh, and it's for 25000 And it's for $25,000. Finals. Who's, who's winning this money, man? Um, Who is leaving with this money? If I gotta, if I gotta take a pick, I, I'm gonna have to go with the, the the legend or the more experienced battler. Mm. I mean, even though it, this is the final for the tournament form, so the underdog is clearly caution. Mm -hmm. She has a lot going for her, and she got the chip on her shoulder when it comes to losing to a vet. So mm. somebody, she gonna have to catch this body on C3. Problem is. C3 ain't one of them cats that you can just sit there and just, just walk all over. It's she not gonna happen. Going. Going. C3 only loses to herself. If she slips up, if she mm. chokes her or something like that, that's the only time. And another thing about C3, I've always said this, but I'm gonna say it again. C3 is very underrated. Mm. She's not rated with the top, like when you think of top female battlers, if you if you really be, if I'm being honest, E Heart get more love than C3. You know what I'm saying? So like when they talk about cold pins and they talk about cold flows, they don't talk about C3 enough. Right. So in that sense, I'm still going to go with who has the better pen. I'm going to have to say C3. But if we're going by moments, I'm going to have to go with Caution. 2-1 either way, but I got to go with C3 with a slight edge. Give me Caution, man. The young, young, up and comer. Yeah. I, I, she got a lot of hungry. bars, real lyrical, real hungry. Um, and I like what she's doing, you know what I'm saying? C3 could win this, you know what I'm saying? But we're just having to, we're just, I'm just going the opposite of you right now. Fuck it. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, <laughs> Official versus Prestavia. Okay, so uh, Official's been around forever. We know Official. Um, most recently seen her in that two-on-two -two with Jazz. You know what I'm saying? She continues to do what she do. We all know Official. Um, Prestavia, Bags and Bodies. I seen her versus Fonz, and I seen her in a couple other battles. And I will say this: I'm I, I got no cut here. I like what she does and what she's able to do, but to me, she's not done it enough. You see what I'm saying? Like. I think that she got mega love when she came in the game and she got with gun titles real quick. Oh shit, surface cosigning the female. Woody mm -hmm. woody woody. Now these good cosigns and having big people in your corner like the Easy's, the Rocks and all of them, mm -hmm. that's great to have. But, but at the end of the day, mm -hmm. we're here for the battles. Yes. Like it ain't about nothing else, you know what I'm saying? And I don't feel like at this point she has put in the requisite groundwork to be even considered in some of these big positions at times. And I'm not, I don't want to sound like a hate because I'm really not hate. It's a, it's a battle, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. If I feel like somebody made it to Summer Madness quicker than they should have, what am I going to do? I'm going to say it, right? right? Now, she's been on Chrome 23 before. Mm -hmm. Did she battle Yoshi on Chrome 23? Yes. Who no, won no, she, yeah, she battled, Chrome, uh, she battled Yoshi on Chrome 23. Who won that battle? Yeah, Prestavia got that battle. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, Prestavia okay, got so she got that battle. She got that battle. Right? Got that battle. Uh, she battled Fonz on URL. Fonz that was down. like... It was just a, it was, it was, she, she was at Bags and Body. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? She, she did, she, she, it's still going it's on. It's still going on, but right. I didn't hear much commotion, right. notion coming up out right. there. Now, maybe she smoked somebody on there, whatever the case may be. But I'm just saying this. You battling against official, official's one of the best to ever do it, especially with the punches and getting crowd reaction that people are going to fuck with her. You know what I'm saying? I just remember seeing official and jazz, like in that two on two mm -hmm. versus uh, Shuni and Farrah. I did have Shuni and Farrah winning that one, though, but I did see some dynamic moments. Well, I might have asked Sure. It was debatable, two one either way, whatever the case may be. <laughs> so now what I say is, I say that to say this: I got love for Stacey. I like what she does. I'm a harsh critic, 
but I need the 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 the, the billing mm -hmm. and the talk mm -hmm. to match with the actual battles. You know what I'm saying? Like, I, if you getting this love and you getting bigged up and you in these crews and in this movement, you doing your thing, you getting all these great opportunities. She got to smoke some. Is official the one? I don't know. How you feel? Um. I really love the way you say things. You know what mm. I'm saying? You know, the pause. It I think that I mean the world. The yeah, world I, I mean, look like I'm, I'm, I'm as a fan, right, 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 and right, also right, right. as a, I like how you say stuff because the way I was gonna say it, it wasn't gonna sound that crazy. The big love and the big hype. I mean, you forget there was a whole four horsemen push in the beginning. Yeah, like it was mad push. I'm shit. just saying. Yo, they wish we were on four horsemen uh -huh. pushes to fucking gun titles. Gun titles. Like, well, how many I was at Summer like, Madness, right? How many? Niggas they had a signing, like a, a gun titles, you know, album release signing type thing. Sign right? She was signing autographs, rocking all white, looking elegant, walking around like she was that girl. But I need the battles to match. But th that's all I'm saying. I I just want. I'm like, yo, you know, that's crazy how she is. But what exactly has she done that's been, you know, better than what she's done now? I can honestly say that her highest, uh, her highest uh, goal was on a Chrome 23. Her impact was on a Chrome 23 and what she did with Yoshi. So this is kind of this can be another situation where she's it's a home game for her. Mm -hmm. Problem is you going up. This is a home game and you like I don't know you OKC mm -hmm. type home game and you're playing the Lakers. I wish I could give you a better. Uh, let's let uh, Giannis. But you're, you're playing in. Right you, uh, well, yeah, right now. That was it. So like, let's let's let's, let's keep it funky. But uh, I'm sorry. But you're playing the Trailblazers. Like we know that official is a killer. We I can say that official is Dame Little because you know what it is when the time when it's when it's clutch time. Mm -hmm. Problem is with this battle is that we don't necessarily know who wants to win it more. Not a lot of not a lot of push between these two. Official is not really big on promo. Prestavia also not big on promo. But one thing I can guarantee you is official is going to have bars. I gotta go with official on this one. I, yeah, I'm gonna I, say I, yeah. It's not it's not a tough decision for me. I'm it's not that hard, but guess what? Dude? Guess what? Resume. Hey, impact. <laughs> Having actual battles, really? winning battles, things like these are the ones that makes me lean towards official. Hey, no I like what Prestavia can do. This is a big opportunity for her. Please don't get down by any mm -hmm. of the comments that we said. That's it is what it is at the end of the day. You're you're a high level battle rapper. You're battling on big platforms. You get judged accordingly. Mm -hmm. I'm saying I think she's nice. I just haven't seen it. Enough. This type of battle is something enough. that can help me see it. Though. Yes. Oh, uh, absolutely. Another type of battle that can help me see it is Vixen versus A Ward. Mm -hmm. uh, both coming off of losses. Mm -hmm. Uh, and you know, Vixen's most recently was to Jazz, mm -hmm. uh, but Jazz is just one of those ones. Like when she's put in predicaments, where she has her back against the wall, or she feels that people is testing her pain game, she's gonna come out firing. Uh, I did have Vixen losing that one. I think Vixen battled Rock not too long before that. I had yep. Rock winning that too. So I have Vixen needing a needing a, a impressive showing. Right. A Ward is coming off battle with Big K, where the majority feels like he lost. I did watch A Ward versus Big K again. And while Big K won clearly all three rounds, I do feel like A Ward, material wise, was pretty much, you know what I'm saying? He does he did what he did. It's just you got an impressive over the top Big K in that battle. If I had to be a, a critic, mm -hmm. if I wanted to be make it even or something like that, is it a is it a thirty for Big K? Yeah, but it wasn't like a a body, because mm -hmm. A Ward's second round, the backwards flow, the rebuttals. Everything that was in that, it was all dope. The reason why I'm saying all that to say is he can do any of that, any and all of that against Vixen. Mm -hmm. Vixen can't rebut. Well, I don't want to say that. But Vixen has rebutted a couple times. Ain't been that crazy. Mm -hmm. But her material and her performance may out, outweigh Award. Mm -hmm. there's, a, there's, a, there's another thing that comes into, with this crew, with the Chrome 23 card, is just that. This crowd is not necessarily battle wrapped out. Come on, like they not necessarily a battle rap ish crowd. It's more, mm -hmm. it's more on the industry side. For Vixen, she can actually pull this one out. The reason why I'm saying that she can pull this one out is because she's going to be a little bit more palatable. She's going to be a little bit more tangible. The performance is going to be there, easy on the eyes as well. Mm -hmm. Not to mention Black History Month. Be, but, and, you know, she kind of has half of an advantage, if you understand what I'm saying. <laughs> Not, you know what I'm saying? 
A Ward right now came off the loss from Big K, he and he kind of needs to win. But he's also the every men's battler. Like A Ward and Danny Myers to me is in the same boat. Like it doesn't matter whether they win or lose. You're gonna see them somewhere else on another card somewhere. Like they, these battles don't really do much for A Ward. Mm -hmm. But for him to test his pin against a woman, oh yeah. Mm -hmm. For him to test his uh, uh, his performance on a whole nother type of crowd mm -hmm. that has never seen him. Literally, A Ward has. If once A Ward gets on this on this uh once he does his battle, he will literally be on every other league but you are exactly. So he has to win this. But the the advantage for A Ward, as far as career wise, he's getting all of the URL battles without ever battling on URL. So if he can yeah. continue to just pick and pry away at battling URL battle rappers, what is he ever need to go? Have he to go never, over there? <laughs> he may be the anomaly. Like he'll continue to battle every single one. He's already battled Ill Will already. He's already battled Luke Castro, Ryder. Like I could just name fifteen URL Rum artists Nitty. here. Rum Nitty, Arsenal. Like he Damn got a better Arsenal. resume. He got a better resume than people that's on URL. You know what I'm saying? But uh, with uh, that being said, with that being said, who you got? <sighs> I'm gonna do it for you. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and put in two one either way. Because, to me, I have no idea who can definitively win right now. Mm -hmm. Both of them are coming off of the I need to win. Mm -hmm. And I'm not trying to pull out the C word. Mm -hmm. But we do need a great back and forth male-female mm -hmm. C word. The closest to right, me, right. the closest to me would probably be Vixen and Rock. All right, right. I like that. Um, yeah, I'll just go to well, yeah. I plead the fifth, man. We'll move on to the next joint. Oh, I'm saying. Uh, Miss Hustle versus Shuni the Rapper. Now, Miss um, mm. Hustle battled on Chrome 23 before. She battled against Couture. I had her losing. Mm -hmm. um, and she's battling now against Shuni the Rapper. Obviously, Chrome 23, Remy Ma's situation. Remy Ma's mad close with Miss Hustle, so these are set up. It's, just, it's, it's your advantage going in, you know what I mean? But Shuni the Rapper is a dope, dope MC. I love what Shuni's able to do. She's done it against guys. She's done it against girls. Uh, she's able, she's from New York, so like being in New York, battling in New York, is not going to be no pressure for her. I'm passing it off. Miss Hustle now, she battled She It Happens, uh, she battled JC, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? She beat JC every round, you know what I'm saying? I know it was on light work. I was never really one that was a huge fan of light work because I felt it took away from the authenticity of the battles when I hear that they're reshooting battles and rehearsing all that. So I was never a fan of light work. That's yeah. my writer. We might have recapped one, re one light work, two. I did Tay Rock versus Swervo, and I did DNA versus Calico. Calico, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yep. DNA smoked Calico. Yeah. So mm -hmm. other than that, I've been, I, I kind of was hands off with like where yeah. I, I wasn't feeling the concept. Well, how about you? Uh, you talking about when pertaining to to light, light work in general? The light work to me is it, it doesn't it, it, it. I literally still have not paid for the app. Oh. I'm gonna give you eight dollars. It's been Matter of fact, I sent you some money. You some bread, you? There you go. You got the money. All right. So he has the money. Come I on. still gotta make the decision on whether I want to get this app. You know what I'm saying? Like, like, he's like, I didn't. Ah, you you sent me what you sent me for. You ain't sent me money. Like, <laughs> and you already recapped twerk, and I was like, ah, I kind of wanted to see that. And I was like, nah, nah, nah. Uh, but no, um, seriously, um, I was gonna say this mm -hmm. um, about shooting the rapper. Mm -hmm. Shooting the rapper is definitely a great opponent who's going to be able to rap, who's going to be able to shake a room, who's going to get reaction in New York. And it's not going to be an, a layup play for Hustle, even if she does win, because uh, like I said, I ain't got no issue. I think Miss Hustle is dope as a female rapper. You know, she calls herself the queen. She's been winning battles. She's been doing her motherfucking thing. I know she does get emotional at times, especially with different people and different artists and spaces and shit like that. I don't be in there, but I just be hearing and seeing mm -hmm. clips and shit. Mm -hmm. So if she's <laughs> focused on the battle, you know what I'm saying? And not the, the face-off or not the argument or not all of the, the subsidiary intangible bullshit that comes with it. Right. She's just showing up to rap, uh -huh. you know, rapping, doing her thing, having a couple people up there. When she had a Couture, it was like 20 people on stage. Couture mm -hmm. had one person and it meant nothing. You know what I'm saying? So what I'm saying is mm -hmm. who, when the rubber meets the road, who you, you, who you like to hear, man? Okay, when it comes to rap. Rap and rapping. And rapping. Right. You know what I'm saying? I clearly have hustle. When I think of performances, when I think of battles, grudge matches, the shit, uh, freestyle. She's on. She's on Hot ninety seven freestyle. She's done an on off. I think she's done an on off. I'm pretty sure she's done an on off. But she does free. When we talking about rap and rapping, 
That's one thing you will never ever take away from Miss Hustle. All. If you don't like Miss Hustle as a person, that's all right. That's your problem. You if you don't like it, 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 but one thing you will not say is that she can't rap. The one, the only other thing that is a factor that may happen, but I hope it doesn't happen for both. Mm -hmm. One is more common than the other. Mm. Is the choking. Mm. If we gonna point, pick out the, uh, if we gonna address the elephant in the room, I'll be that one to tell you that goddamn is an elephant right there. Yeah. Shonita Rapper has been under a few different battle events where either she's slipping up, choking, mm -hmm. not remembering her bars. Having somebody help her with the bars behind her type of situation. Mm -hmm. Whereas I've only seen Hustle maybe choke. Well, I've never seen it, but remember they edited it out. They did these two times that they edited it out, and there's a rehearsal. That, like everything when it comes to Hustle, it's behind the scenes mm -hmm. versus Shuni, it's happening right in front of you. Correct. With that being said, H Miss Hustle is definitely going to be the better rapper. Mm -hmm. I just feel like, I do feel like. If Shuni is clean and and gives us three complete rounds and have a really good angle right. on how my best friend beat your ass ten years ago, mm. you can't deny a win for Shuni. Who needs this win? Shuni. Shuni by far, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, but I'm saying, if I'm picking, if I'm making a regular bet, hustle. But I won't be surprised if Shuni gets the upset. Right, right, and I could go with that notion. And my thing is this, you know, um, Shuni has long been regarded to as one of the dope female MCs, but she never been regarded to as that one, like the one. I've seen Jazz be regarded to as the one. I've seen Hustle be regarded to as the one. I've seen uh, Official be regarded yeah. to. I've seen a lot of different females be regarded Vixen to. Like that Vixen too. Uh, that been regarded to as the top, top, top female, mm -hmm. but it hasn't been Shuni, but battles like this, could help set her year up right, Easy. you know what I'm saying? Like a battle, a clear win versus a Miss Hustle in New York is gonna, could be really big. Another thing that could be really big is none other than. Also to me, what has now became the most important battle of 2023. Already. Nothing but Easy to Block Captain versus Hitman Holler. And I'll explain this mm -hmm. in my preface why I feel like it's the biggest battle of 2003. Number one, it is one of the highest viewed battle rappers of all time. Mm -hmm. You know, wilding out, bags and bodies, and so many other accomplishments that I could talk about, you know what I mean? But for real, it's just Hitman Hollow. Like, what he's been able to do, what he's been able to accomplish, and who he's became as a person now versus a young, upcoming, rising star in Easy to Black Cabin. Easy to Black Cabin's road to success was not a quote-unquote easy one. Mm -hmm. uh, he got locked up, came out. Had to find his footing in battle rap, and he's been in and out of battle rap since like 2016, 17. Like you can go back and find battles of him versus uh, Clean Paper, him versus a uh, Dot, him versus like Mad People from Sway. I think like he's had, he's got battles out there. He's been around, mm. but he didn't get his footing until like 2019. You know what I'm saying? Like 2020, 21 type shit. Like the 19, 20, 21 early run of the app era. Mm. You know his battle. One day I landed on. A, um, I was watching. It was on YouTube, and I seen Easy the Black Captain versus Swag Tanner on there, and I watched the battle. I didn't really know who he was at the time. I heard about him. I hear about a lot of these niggas, but that don't mean that I just because I heard about you don't mean that I know about you. You know what I'm saying? Right. So, um, I, I I watched that battle one day, and I noticed that he had some shots. I was like, yo, he, he all right, man. Yeah. yeah, I didn't think he was all right to where he, he was gonna get noticed. And he, yeah, yeah, I ain't think all that. Mm -hmm. But then I seen he had wound up in the Ultimate Madness tournament when he landed there. I was kind of like. What is he doing? You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna hold you. This is the truth. This is the hour of the truth. He wasn't. I was like, who is this nigga number one pick? Like, he's not the number one pick. Nope. Don Marino, I think, was the number one pick. Maybe at the time. higher than him. No, it was kick ass at that time. But they was up there. Yeah. But after that, Easy went in the tournament. He battled Don Marino. He won. He battled Fonz. He did good. Fonz won the battle, but Easy won on the app. And Easy's like 12 and 13 and no since then. He just went on a phenomenal run. And honestly, he outran the app. I mean, that's a whole nother episode that we could talk about, but I honestly think he outran his contract, outran the position that he was in. Mm -hmm. When have we seen somebody come on a URL and in their first like big year on there, you get DNA, T-Top, K-Shine, A-Verb, uh, Calico, Goods, like it was just battle after battle after battle after battle. He just went a chess, like it was like, this nigga went on one of the craziest runs I've ever seen, you know what I'm saying? 
Like, all of his battles, boom, 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 line them up. If you look at all of the wars that he's had, mm -hmm. it's been a lot of them. Right. And he's come out unscathed, you know? I don't He's he, the closest thing to, like, a debatable debatable he had was versus Chess. Chess. You know what I'm saying? That was, a, that was the battle of the year last yes, year. Yes, it was. So. Yes. Everything that I keep, even, you know, what I'm saying, even thing, everything that I keep saying keep to help build him, I'm gonna keep on going. Mm -hmm. So he did that, and then he got a call, two calls that MCs, a lot of MCs are never gonna get. He got a call from Murder Moot, and Murder Moot found out that the battle was too close. So he found out with that he must have watched the battle too easy to block caps. And the nigga said, "Oh wait, oh oh oh." oh. You want me to battle that nigga? Mm -hmm. He got to go lose a couple times first, then I'm going to be the first one in line to take him. So he had to chill. He was like, yo, I'm good on this. Um, and now he's got a bigger call for Hitman Hollow. Now, do I think URL was happy about the battle? No. Do I think they was happy it got booked? No. Do I think that they were ecstatic to see that it was still going on? No. Mm -hmm. But there were some things that were involved that I felt like for them would have probably been too bad of a PR move to say, Remy Ma is our sister, and we taking Remy Ma to court over a fucking battle. So I knew, like, sometimes you gotta know when to hold. Know when to fold. <laughs> you got to... Oh, sorry, my bad. You gotta know when to hold and when to fold. Because I'm gonna tell you like this. If that shit would have played out like that, it would have got ugly on the internet streets. We like, was having man. conversations behind, yeah, behind man, the scenes. This, we said, like, happening? hey, is this battle is happening? Is this really happening? I ain't gonna uh, go because I ain't show. Sure. Yeah, I ain't gonna go because <laughs> I ain't show. Sure. And now I'm to the point where this, the world needs the recap yeah. more than they need me there. So, yeah. you know, I came to the realization that, you know, everyone, I'm not gonna be at everyone. You know what I'm saying? Outside. The crowd needs the easy to block captain versus hitman when the battle ends yes. recap. Yes. You know, my man SP was just at Summer Madness and I was just, just a bunch of shit. So you'll see us. We'll, we, you will see us. Yeah. We'll be around. But for this one, I think after the face off and after yeah. all things that are involved, we, we have made a collective decision that we need to see this. Yeah. Not with niggas standing on my feet, no. smoke, blow smoke no. in my face. Not with me having to rush to the car and try to get my phone. No, no, no. I need to see this in the comfort of my home. Thanks. But I would suggest, you know, everybody who's not there, not in a peculiar yeah. situation like us, you can be there, you can watch it, you know what I'm saying? Love it. But here's the deal. So Hitman, very entertaining performer, you know what I'm saying? Known to rise to some of the biggest levels of battle rap. Mm -hmm. uh, has had big battles, you know, has done his thing and has, you know, went his own route. Like, he hasn't been on URL in a little minute, and I don't know if he will be. I know Easy to Black Captain vs. Sitman and Holla is a battle that, well known behind the scenes, URL could not book. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. They couldn't book this battle if they wanted to. Because mm -hmm. uh, Hitman not playing about that. You know? Well, from what I'm also understanding is, you know, Hitman charged niggas for what they did to the Gold Crusher. So I'm just going to keep doing it. Hello. Keep rolling. Um, so let's get to the raps, man. Mm -hmm. um, lyrically, mm -hmm. straight up lyrically, subject matter, substance. I like what Easy to Black Captain does right now. You know what I'm saying? I've seen his shit translate in many different rooms. Mm -hmm. He's got these pockets of flows where, you know, he could be like, he could just jump into all type of shit where he's like, you know, uh, made the strap, made the strap. If you give me that hard work cover, I need my paper back. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. and shit that they seen him do versus chess. Yeah. The one thing about Easy punch and Hitman, he could pu I punch and talk to Same a nigga. I'm um, saying battle. <laughs> um, Easy to Black Captain style is translatable anywhere. It's, it's like Visa. It's accepted everywhere. Yeah. It's going to work. I know what Easy to Black Captain does is going to work. I ain't heard a single word from him. But I've seen enough battles to know it will work. Now, on the flip side of that coin, I've seen enough of Hitman Holler to know what he does is going to work. You know what I'm saying? Like, with Hitman Holler, let's just say, we're just figuratively saying, we're just figuratively saying, mm -hmm. Uh, you know, Hitman Holla comes out there and yeah, he starts rapping that shit and he hits that nigga well, you need the permission to be here type shit. Like that shit starts re translating well. What is hit what is easy to black captain gonna say that's gonna befuddle what Hitman Holla has to say? They both have direct angles. How far do they didn't wanna go? Do they wanna get personal? Is Hitman gonna bring Show out out? You know what I'm saying? Show out's in prison. Is he? I think Show out's in jail. Oh well if he is free to gang, but uh what is, is Hitman going to do a remix? Is, what is he doing? You know what I'm saying? What is his level of attack? Now, if there's anybody that I trust on this level of having a big battle, it is Hitman Holler because he showed up against some people. A lot of people, people felt like he was not going to beat, mm -hmm. and he won. Um, toss it to you, man. What's up? I appreciate the way that you chef that up. 
I'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing what you did, but I'm gonna go ahead and mix it up with a little bit. It's gonna seem like a little hate, but it's gonna be on both sides. Here is the issue, or here's the main question. Who needs to win the battle? Needs, needs. Who to win. needs to win this battle? All right, let's do it like this. I wanna say something, right? I'm gonna ask the same question mm -hmm. with that Hitman Holler ask. What's the bigger headline? Hitman Holler beats Easy to Block Captain mm -hmm. or Easy to Block Captain beats Hitman Holler? What's the bigger headline? You already answered your question by right, answering so, them. I'm just saying Easy to Block Captain. So, so I just answered it. So, All right, cool, we so, good. So, Easy to Block Captain clearly needs to win this battle. Correct. What's the worst thing that can happen to Easy to Block Captain if he loses this battle? Uh, nothing. 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 It ain't on URL. nothing. Say that. What you say? If it ain't on URL, it, it don't count, right? Okay. So that's that's point four. Who needs to win? That's a ball in the court for Hitman Holler. Mm -hmm. The reason why I'm saying Hitman Holler needs to win this battle because this continues to be the talk of. It does not matter where I'm at, wherever I go, whoever you put in front of me, they are food. Mm -hmm. Right. <clears throat> There's always speculation when it comes to Hitman Holla actually losing because Hitman Holla doesn't oh, lose. Really battle, yeah. the, even the battle that you could think about it as far as Hitman Holla's whole career is concerned, the loss that he might have got or the loss that you would say that he had is Wait. versus Averb and, and Surf. A lot of people lose. What shit. happens when you shoot with the stars and you fall amongst the clouds? You still higher than everybody shit. else. Yeah, Same situation that goes for Easy to Block Captain. If Easy to Block Captain loses to Hitman Holler, you just go on a list of other niggas that have lost to Hitman Holler. But it's not a loss. It's not, it's not, it ain't, you don't go back to, 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 to the PGs or the Ground Zeros or the 1SKs. You don't do that when you lose to Hitman Holler. Mm -hmm. So, for this battle is going to be the safest battle for Easy to Block Captain mm. because they keep giving them new names. They keep giving them all of them names. But the one thing that a lot of people keep saying, but they not really comprehending that, is that Easy is going to have to lose. He's going to lose one of these things. One of these days. I'm not saying it's going to be the Hitman Holler. But what happens when Easy loses? Mm. He's already at a level now where if he loses, it's really not going to be that bad. And it's funny when he said something in the face off, mm -hmm. it made me think, hmm, you might be getting a little bit too ahead of yourself. Mm. The reason why I'm saying this ain't easy, I fucks with you heavy, you my man's is Philly all day. Mm -hmm. But when you said, as of right now, I'm bigger than Geechee Gotti, what you should have said was they got me on the same train as Geechee Gotti. Because when you was going down a resume for, uh, for Easy to Block Actor, these are all the names that Geechee has had. Mm -hmm. um, only people, the only person that, like, only people that I'm thinking of that ain't got them. Murder Moop. Uh, you got Murder Moop, Hollow the Don, you got Math Hoffa, you got uh, uh, John John the Don, you got uh, Loaded Lux, you got all of these names that rum, he's battled the rum niggas more than once. More than twice, actually. You know what I'm saying? He's got his battles with Twerk. The same battles that we want for Easy, Geechee Gotti has already been tested. So, as of right now, yes, you are the trending topic. You would be higher than Geechee Gotti, but it's not to say that you, if you, if you, if I'm talking, we might be a hair underneath it. But if we're talking star power, oh, yeah. it's Hitman Howard. You can feel it, man. I'm, I'm, I, 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 the whole time I was breaking this down, and I mean, I'm, I, listen, what we do is playing in my head. You get what I'm saying? Flip side is playing in my head as I'm thinking of this. And as much as my Philly pride stands tall, I really feel like Hitman Holla is going to get the first two rounds. Mm. If I'm wrong, mm. easy to block, Captain. Gets the second. He gets the second and the third. I'm a but if I gotta take my pick, we going stuff. It's 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 the talk is different, but that star power is different. Hitman don't lose, but he, he easy don't lose either. But I'm just, I'm just saying if we going once again, it's a betting man's game, and if I, I bet, I, I just let like, I'm saying you know where I go. You know where I'm going. You know where I'm going. Go ahead. I know where you're going. I know where you going. <laughs> I don't like it, man. I don't like how you trying to do my man right now. 
Uh, no, a little seriously. bit of hate on both sides. But oh, oh, my bad. And just, a, just a, my bad, cause it sounded like I was going a little too hard on this. Yeah, right, right. Allow me to throw that hate on the Hitman Hollow. Okay. Hitman Hollow has a lot more to lose. Mm. He has so much more to lose. If he loses to Easy the Block Captain, that means that bag that you're asking for on that league that you t that you robbing him for the uh, for you that you charge him for the cold crush. Guess what? That price gets chopped in half. I'm not saying it. I'm just nah, saying a little. Yeah, but it's, it's because right. of the gunner that we had, you killed one of the gunners that we just groomed up. So what type of damage would you do versus the Geechee Gotti? Yeah. You see what I'm saying? It's it's a level of if Hitman Hitman Howard has so much more to lose. A loss versus easy to block captain. You get lost. You get a loss in views when it comes to bags and bodies. Ain't nobody trying to come to bags and bodies right now. You lose it to rookies or newbies. You lose it. Hitman Holler got so much more to lose. That buildup, the whole emotional Hitman Holler that we see, right? Anytime that the bloggers talk bad about him, he gonna run, he gonna run up on him. But this is about that time where you, Hitman Holler, have to show us why you are that star that is so desperately needed to be in that limelight. Alright. When the man. I saw Hitman last week, yes, about two did. weeks ago. <laughs> you um, did. Now, I did, yeah. We ran into each other at uh, Waffle House in Atlanta. Salute to Atlanta. Salute mm -hmm. to Waffle House. And uh, we definitely chopped it up for a second. And he definitely told me that he was ready, you know, to say it was going to be a movie. He was ready for the for the show. Um, I'm going to say this. I have easy to black after win. I know you do. The reason why, listen, I'm from the Bronx, <laughs> so I don't got no dog in the fight, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm just saying. I ain't based seen you. Off of, I ain't seen you out pick. I ain't, I'm about to say I ain't never seen you go against Easy either. So, uh, uh, you know, depends on the situation. The battle. My bad. And, the only time you went against Easy was Fonz. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah. So it's happened. Don't act like it ain't happened. You know what I'm saying it's happened. What? Uh, uh, no, it's a term called strike while the iron's hot, man. And um, I do feel like right now, uh, in the battles that I've seen Easy in. Uh, he's been into, he's battled against some really really big names. Hitman Holler is qu quite obviously going to be the biggest name that he's going to battle yes. against, and it's going to be in New York. So he does have disadvantages because he hasn't battled in front of a New York crowd of over a thousand. You know what I'm saying? We give it up a little bit different in New York. But I'm just kind of going to be on easy side because they like what they hear. Like I'm telling you, I know what these niggas want to hear. You know what I'm saying? They want to hear that street talk, that drug talk, yeah. that plug talk. They want to hear that shit. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Hitman gonna have to control the room. He's gonna have to have moments. He's gonna have to have some punches in it. He gonna have to, you know, you know, you got hit an easy way. You know, you know that type of shit he can do. You know what I'm saying? But you gonna expect a couple of those. What I like to call big stage bars. Like he gonna Hitman Holla has big stage bars. Mm -hmm. He brings a stage presence. But Easy the Black Captain has shown me requisite stage presence. Yeah. I, you know, like you said, um, fucking. Uh, my thoughts get clouded. You can't think until I talk about it. Don't say think about it, because when I get to that point, I already, I already thought, thought about like it. Same battle. Like, we keep naming the same battle, but yeah, I'm just saying. I'm... It's the reason why. <laughs> talk different. It's a reason. You know, you guys, my... I put that Confederate flag in front of my trap house Ooh, and ain't going to That shit, that line going viral. Somebody's stealing it. They Somebody's took stealing it. it. That shit everywhere now. Personally, my, my personal favorite is you said sandwich bags was one for sandwiches. <laughs> My bad, but go ahead. I'm very, but I, overall, I'm not gonna lie. I'm it's, very excited very for this battle. I must say, supreme shout out to Remy Ma. You know oh, what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. uh, to Chrome 23 and to all of the, the headaches and loopholes and things that I know that they had to do to put this together because it's essential to have leagues like the Chrome 23s, like the independent leagues, because at the end of the day, we do need these independent you know what I'm saying, entities to continue to put out product, to continue to have battles. Because, listen, I don't, I'm don't. i not a one-league guy. I don't want to see everything on one damn league. I'd rather see some shit over here, yeah. see some shit over there. When everybody's bubbling, making moves, it's better for the culture because you're going to get better battles. If one league is only throwing all the battles, they can book whatever they want. But if a person across the street is booking this battle, that's big. They booking that battle, that's big. Now we want to see what they're going to do. Is it going to be just as big or what? So for me personally, I love competition in the battle world it environment. It has to be like that. I'm, I'm but I got easy 2-1. I, 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 I was wondering where you were at. Yeah, don't, 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 don't skip. Do not skip. Mm -hmm. Do not skip mm -hmm. my pick. I know. 2-1.
And I will be right. You working? Where you gonna be at? Yeah, yeah, where yeah, you gonna be? Yeah, I'm going you got work? Where you gonna be? I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be at work. Yeah, well, is it Saturday? Is it Saturday? Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, be you're gonna, work. gonna be working at work. Be at work. All right, cool. But well, you already know. You, you already. Well, you ain't gonna be hard to find. Depending on how this Chrome 23 car go out, I might have time to go home. Come oh back. yeah, see that? And that's another thing. Like, and this is another Yo, thing about being there. No intermissions, bro. I need no intermissions, bro. <laughs> I know y'all would love people. You know, see people, but bro, some of these events, yo, you be at the event, you be there nine hours. 10 hours. I've been events till 1.30, 2.30 yeah. in the morning. Yeah, so My feet, good, dog, good, I hours. am not the youngest puppy in the kennel anymore. No. I ain't got the feet <laughs> for it, man. I do it, I love it, I've been out, but I think this is one that I could really see on TV. Yeah. I, you know what I'm saying? And I love it and I'm gonna support it. We gonna support it and we love what's going on. One last thing, and because of that, we need that audio and that visual on 100, because I will not get on this camera and lie. <laughs> and be like, oh man, the stream was great. No, if it was oh, trash. Oh, I thought he was gonna say <laughs> If it was trash, I'm gonna tell you, I ain't seen no battles. Damn, That's man. what I'm saying. But, but it is what it is, man. Salute to Chrome 23. You already know what to do. Game. Shout out to Sis Rim. Hey. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Bye -bye.